We are getting ready, finally, for the Momocon 2023 semifinals for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I am excited. I am ready. We are getting going. And oh my goodness, this is the first 12 out of 132 competitors who are trying to get in the money. So let's talk about a few of the other players. We got through some of them, like Greg was next on the list, but we talked about him in the last thing. Let's talk about Crow, a man from Michigan who entered the FFA and the 2v2. He's on Fire Hydra, a D1 team, man. He, he has notable wins at a victory at a one lives, two plays, only Mario Kart land. So that was nice on him. One of the longest tenured members of the community going back as Mario Kart Wii era. Wow, that is very awesome. Very, very cool. I mean, a lot of Division 1. So if you don't understand the 6v6 team, you have like 20 different divisions, which is the lowest, and then you have D1, which is the highest in the 6v6 scene in Mario Kart. So when it comes down to it, we have so many talented top of the division, top of the leaderboard type racers here in this semifinals. This is the very first race out of 12. We are starting it on this orange Yoshi, this which is with Bobby Bobby. This is on Shroom Bobby. Ridge, folks. As Shroom Ridge, Bobby decides to purposely burn out and bag just a little bit. There are some uh, ways to cut corners. If you don't know what bagging is, can you explain to the folks at home what bagging is? Yeah, bagging is basically being able to go back, grab some really powerful items, and then using the off-road to your advantage. You're going to be able to grab these coins, and go off into the off-road to catch up a lot faster or potentially grab shock to ruin 11 other racers day because when you're able to grab 10 coins you get a 2.5 percent top speed bonus so it's very very important that you grab 10 coins and you're able to catch back look, up look with at those the powerful intensity items of this dude right now rocking back and forth with the chair just having his mindset on only what's in front of him that's crow folks and right now, he just tripped oh! the board. He got a three for one hit. What a triple kill. My god, beautiful boomerang usage there. Going to be able to grab another double item box. Just going to throw the boomerang forward. Sees the banana. Going to be able to avoid it. Still in third place. Oh, almost oh, hits the oh, car. Oh, 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 almost gets hit by the bullet oh, bill. God. Shot comes down. Between a car, between another car, between a bullet bill. Shock out of nowhere. That really, was... out of all those things that could have hit him, that was the one thing that did. Crow was absolutely avoiding chaos, but you cannot avoid natural disasters, I'm sorry to say, like a shock. Top Let's... six are moving on in 12 races. Jake up is now here in third place, has a red shell in hand, sees the red coming. Using that back hammer is so useful. If they didn't use it, they wouldn't have known if it was going behind him or to him. Throws the red shell forward, has a bomb okay, in hand. Jumped off the ground just to try to get at Miles. Two That's, bullet bills oh, on the oh. way. Backs the ball under the schism. He said for Mario, do you want to explode? He watched too much Despicable Me last night. Has a red shell in hand. Goes all the way down to ninth place. Jacob battling it out with Dash. Goes oh. to 10th. Goes to 9th. And grabs a ninth place finish oh. all the way from that, third. Van Toxin first. Miles in second. Bobby in third. Roberto in fourth. Uh, Greg Island fifth. And Roberto in sixth. Good, good starts for them. When you're in these semifinals, it's 12 races. So you have so much time. If you didn't do too well, shake it off. Just say, I'm going to do better in the next race and really figure out what went wrong. Did you not have 10 coins? Did you get hit out too much? Were you not aware of your surroundings? Were you not using the back camera? Really think about these things while you're in this lobby, while you're trying to get your mental ready for the next well, good race. Good start for Van Talk. Man won the Play X online tournament not so long ago for Mario Kart League. Oh, Championship. what? And we're going to Toad's Turnbike, a track that, while it favors inside drifting players like myself, I hate this track. It's boring. I don't, you know what? We get this at Saturday Night Speedway all the time. This and track I'm sucks. It does. It really does. It's just a figure eight. It's got cars. We already dealt with cars. It's got cars. <laughs> that, that's our highlight for this track. It does. That it got cars. I like cars on the track. True Ridge did not have cars. I think, no, that's what I'm saying. We just dealt with the cars. <laughs> So we get them again. The Berlin Byways, does that have cars? Yeah, I, I like the cars. It makes it immersive <laughs> in my opinion. I don't know. But granted, like, uh, where are they exiting on this track? That's what I want to know. Where are these cars going? That's what are I they being know. paid? What type of freeway is a figure A and where is the exit? That's a good question. I'm still asking that to this very day. But we are on Jacob right now, who's just behind Van Tox, and oh. runs into the truck. 
That's brutal. Only going to drop down to six, though, which is not too bad. On this track, the main thing, grabbing those 10 coins and protecting yourself. Ow. But unfortunately, Jacob could not grab the items in we time. Got got it back up. was like going on and uh, out, in and out of bounds. Like, what was happening? Immortal on what? screen uses the red. I wouldn't have used the red there at all. I no, would have just focused you. on just protecting yourself and be I'm like there you go using it for drag rather than being aggressive because you don't know what's behind you and what's coming schism is behind immortal right now with those triple shrooms whoa, sees the bomb whoa. sees the crazy eight schism gonna be able to run into immortal though dropping him down to sixth place hey hey he's collecting coins he's out of coins right now he just used his drag banana to drag someone out but gets hit by back green because he can see it with the ink on his face Oh, oh really wants a star, but that person has another star in hand. He's got to be very careful not to touch him, or else he's going to be suffering a similar fate that he just already experienced. Dash in front, Bantox in second with the horn. Oh, almost gets hit by that smart bounce. Got to be careful. You're going to be seeing a lot of these competitors be just spamming their back camera to try and get any information of what's happening behind them as fast as possible. Go, go, go. So, with an air horn in hand, let's see what they're going to be able to do. Green shell, red shell is out. Triple reds. Got Miles the, has it. He's got to dodge something here. Oh, there it goes. But Miles, has, I don't know oh. if it's not red or not. But there's a blue shell. It's going after Dash. That's going to land before the finish line. So, that's going to allow Bantox to grab this first back place. Dash is going perfectly, which he does it. He's trying oh. to play. Did he hit the truck? No, Bantox grabs first place on Toad's Turnpike. The patience that this man had to use the shroom at the last second to pass Dash, who probably used one of the trucks to avoid the blue, and that's why he was able to pull out the red so fast with the invincibility frames. Really great stuff there. I mean, I, you, you, you got to just accept two it. two for two on first. Oh, wow. Really good stuff there. I mean, Bantox, like we know him, just came out to Las Vegas not too long ago, completely dominated that free for all tournament, and now coming out to Edge or coming out to Momocon here, and being able to just do the same thing again. I'm just is saying, so cool. if, if we had like a fantasy league, man, like a fantasy draft, but I don't know why you didn't uh, put fan talks in your fantasy draft. That's your fault. That's your <laughs> I, fault. I, I've been saying that. I feel like a Mario Kart fantasy league would be really cool. There I, is I, technically I honestly, a fantasy league for the six v six online. Oh yeah, there is. There is. That, yeah, I think that's fun because they're just. The, the level of skill really changes with every Mario Kart racer because yes, you can have yes. really fast lines. You can know really how to fast. maneuver through these tracks really so fast. easily. But then there's other racers that are still learning those strategies, learning when you to use these mini turbos, learning when and where to do these. And it's like the only... We got DK Jungle, but I was talking about the Twitch <laughs> chat from what I just saw. Uh, sneak, sneak, uh, how dare you say I this? had no idea I don't know who Van Talks, talks was. <laughs> Goodbye. What? <laughs> Why are you calling someone out, or is that you? Or are you calling yourself out? I don't know, but we are on Van Talks right now, who is Princess Peach. You know what? We got to do this. We got to sing Peaches. Why not? Peaches, 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 Peaches. peaches. <laughs> oh, I love that movie. I've done it 12 times already because of Amazon. Thank you, Amazon. <laughs> But this is actually interesting because in the map selection, this was the only base original 48 track that was picked. All the rest were DLC, which I thought is actually kind of interesting. Vantox, though, doesn't have any defense to avoid that red shell coming their way. Going to drop with the 12th. Let's see if they can catch back up. Like I said, it's only the first lap. We got Daisy over there looking to fight around fourth and fifth place just based on the mini map there. Vantox with the shroom in last place, but he's probably doing a little bit of bagging here. Maybe he's trying to pull shock. Maybe he's trying to get a bullet bill. Who knows what he's thinking right now? But we are on our next opponent here who's playing Link with the shroom right behind Manclore, right behind Immortal. Yeah, honestly, on a track like Donkey Kong Jungle, there are not many shortcuts you can take. So bagging oh, is whoa, not whoa, optimal whoa, whoa. here. Great, gonna get hit by fire, drop down to seventh place, mushroom in hand, gonna be able to do a super bounce, which is one of the strategies I was talking about, where you get so much more distance yep. if you're able to do that. Absolutely, you gotta be careful with that banana. He wanted that other coin, but he saw where the banana was, made a quick decision not to run into it. I don't know how. Oh! That, I don't know how that sequence happened, but it happened before the banana, and unfortunately he couldn't move around. Schism in ninth, you got Jacob in seventh, it looks like, or six. Crow in ninth now. Oh, you just hit red, but does it doesn't get the double item box, which is gonna leave them super vulnerable. And with how aggressive these Whoa, no, whoa, Bobby, whoa, what? whoa, 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 whoa,
things can change or they can remain the same. And you got Jacob over here in fourth, fighting off the dash in second, schism in third. I don't even know who's in first, but there's a blue shell. Oh, blue shell on oh, the way. No, oh, did see How the... could you have predicted that banana? It, I mean, honestly, it's big brain placements for the people who use that shortcut. Place the banana there for anyone who is coming there next. But still, Jacob in fourth place has the double item box. Grabs. Oh, oh, oh not no. no defense. Still, mushrooms put him back up to top speeds. Going to use two. Oh. Going to use three. Gets around the chaos. Doesn't get bumped off. Grabs sixth place. No, he got eighth. What are you talking about? Oh, wow, he got wow, wow, wow. Last second. Roberto in first, Dash in second, Skizzle in third, Merlo in fourth, Miles in fifth, and McElroy in sixth for that race. Woo! I gotta breathe, man. I gotta breathe. I need some water. Where, where, where's that water? Where's that water? I looked at? down. Woo. I'm like, okay, I saw them in six. I you looked down looked real down second. You looked down at the wrong time I'm until like, they passed the line. That is, is that, that never happens. That tells you how quick, within the matter of milliseconds, things can change. Yeah, that never happens in Las Vegas for our Mario Kart That's event. our players Never. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> They're in the chat. You can't say that. That's rude. Hey, oh. I gave a promo telling them that they need to get better, okay? I think I have a right to keep telling them that they need to get better. That, that, oh, man, that, that was that was brutal because I, that's happened a couple other times, I've realized, where it's just you think they've already crossed the line because it goes away, but then, boom, they lose two spots. And those two spots can be the make it or break it situation of making it in the grand finals. And we're going to Snooze Summit once again because apparently it's a popular track pick. We'll have to see as we go into DK Summit once again. Look at how close these point totals are, though, man. Like, it can literally be yeah. a game changer for getting first place and normal getting, like, fourth or fifth, and you can change up the standings dramatically. Yeah, it really can. I mean, it, we're only on four out of 12, so there is a lot of points on the board to be had. We're going to be starting off on Miles, though, and they are in fifth place. Not going to get an item box, which is brutal. Especially on this cannon section where you have no defense, you can get hit down. At least but thankfully, no one else did either. Off the track. I can say that much. Enjoy the scenery, folks. I do like the scenery, but the track in general. Collect them coins, my man. You need to get those riches. Yeah, I, I mean, I have never you want seen money, that track. Right? That's smart. The problem with the DLC tracks is that they don't have a lot of coins. So that was actually really, or, really smart. Oh, they're super far wide and out of your way. Yeah, what? so why not just get up to that 10 coin top speed boost? and then work your way up. As long as you know the strategy, you know the lines to get yourself up to the front of the pack, you'll be good to go. You see, I'm already at fifth place. Uh, I believe when the chat says I'm spilling, I think you mean spitting. Oh uh, yeah, there like you I'm go. Spitting <laughs> like I'm spitting fire. Like if I'm saying I'm spilling, I'm spilling water. Okay, that's a mistake. Huge I think loadout you need here. to fix that. <laughs> Huge loadout here for both Zach and Miles at this point, going to be able to pop that star. And oh my goodness, I do believe that we might be seeing something happen. Yeah, there it is! Shock dodge for Miles. Gonna, and not make the gap jump! No, no, no. You fall so hard, it, it just hurts. It hurt. it is. And you know what, to shock dodge and then not make the jump is brutal. Oh no, dude, like, it's not easy at times. Like, it, they make it look easy, but it takes some time and practice to get that gap jump right there, man. It really but does. it saves almost five to six seconds off of a time trial, and that's five to six seconds you're out blasting your opponent. What, what happened to that bomb? <laughs> Bantox just you think I'm totally gonna avoided that? the bomb. I'm not gonna let that go. What happened to that bomb? I think that Bantox probably backed an item and then it connected to that maybe, thankfully, but when you're going in a, a cannon section like that, that items get thrown a lot faster. And we got, oh, they made it, yay! Made the gap jump there, moving all the way up. Oh, gotta be careful of that snowboarding shy guy right there. He does take a little crack, gets no. shot, loses his eyes, gets past the two field builds, doesn't get past again, he's on through! Gets six, no! He was at fourth. That was Zach. We got Chrome first, Van Tox in second, Jacob in third, Dash in fourth, Bobby in fifth, and Zach in sixth. Yeah, that's brutal, but still, being able to grab six Ooh. places is really good. Like I talked about, top six consistently will give you Ooh. enough points to move on. But if you're having these really rough 12th place, 11th place, 10th place, just consistently in a row, you're not going to have a good time. 
You're gonna have a bad time if you don't do things properly, man. You gotta practice, you gotta train. That's where time trials comes in for those racing lines. This is where online comes in for the item management. And then it's just you having the mentality to constantly keep practicing, practicing no matter how many times you fail until you get it right. So consistent that you can do it online and be the dominant factor. Exactly. Or even in land. Exactly. Let's Super Bowl subway. Let's, Let's go. go. Please pick yeah, it. Yeah, Please yeah, pick yeah, it. Yeah, I yeah, love yeah, Super Bowl. Yeah. Everyone, else gives us, everyone else gives us flack for it. I want it as we're going to Ninja Hideaway. Ninja Hideaway is a really fun track. I know it's you don't particularly. Track. It is. Like once you get to the rooftop sections, you don't want to trick every single time. It's easy to fall off. It is not a very easy track to race on. So, so just going off by the point totals of what we got so far, we have Van Tops with 46 points, Bobby with 33, and Merle with 28. Greg Island with 18, Dash with 38, Jacob with 22, Zach with 17, Miles with 32, Schism with 29, Roberto with 30, Mancolor with 17, and Crow with 18. Oh, a lot of catching up to do for some of these competitors, but only on race 5 of 12. So still a lot of time and points on the board. We're starting on Immortal here, working the way up to 6th place. Oh, be up careful. To they dragged him. What? Oh. How did he not get hit by that? There's no way. But That's what I like to pass. see. Mario Kart and he got get that is that is brutal. But and gets ready. Right there we go. Bye. <laughs> Finally gets hit by an item after uh, so much. Doesn't get dragged here. He hits the brake button, so he prevents himself from getting dragged. But he couldn't stop the red there. There was no wall to wall dodge with. Oh, slows down. Sees the triple red. Said, you know what? I'm just, oh my! Oh! How he pulled it? He loses two greens to that one single red. Yeah, how? <laughs> what is happening? How did he get hit and fall off the track? That just tells you he gets bumped off. This is like Mario Kart Double Dash where you can bump the guy off by hitting them. This is the 30% oh RNG God. that I was talking about where it's just this nothing is the 20%. gets on your side. No, that was the 80% skill, 20% RNG. What are you talking no, about? No, that was 30% RNG right there. I don't believe right it's 30. I believe it's 20. Okay, fine. Fair. We got Mantox on the screen right behind Jacob in front of him in third place. Sees the fire in hand. Got to just go wide. Don't get hit here. Does get Ow. hit, unfortunately. Got to slow down for the boxes. Arrow horn in hand. Skids him in front Can of him. Can I hear the sound coming. horn? Oh, never mind. They're sorry. He's not going to do it just yet. Not just yet, but has the... Bro, you know can probably use it to avoid fire. I wouldn't blame him. Well, oh, he does take out Roberto's dragged red, but now his triple greens have been pulled out. That's brutal. Getting hit by the star, dropping all the way down to 11th on this final lap. Has, a, has only a fire in hand with no competitors in front of him, so that's going to be pretty worthless for the time being. And now, moving over, second place here, one mushroom in hand. Going to be able to see Bobby in first place. Let's see if I they grab the items they need. Bro, got to avoid the blue shell. Bobby's going to take the hit unless he has the dodge. No, he doesn't. Now we got a new first place. Finish right here. I believe that was Crow. Crow grabbing first place. Bobby in second. And look at the gap on Ninja Hideaway. It's showing the difficultness of this track. Crow in first. Bobby in second. Dash in third. And Greg in fourth. Zach in fifth. And Roberto in six. Really great stuff there. Oh, I need a breathe. I need a breeze. Saying all that so fast, I couldn't even get to the bottom six. But there's a tie for sixth place between Crow and Miles as of right now. First and second, That's two insane. point difference. Second and third, three point difference. Uh, well, third and fourth, eight point difference. Fourth and fifth, two point difference. Fifth and the tied sixth, two point difference. That's how close they are. And sixth and eighth is a three point difference. Yeah, that literally still sixth through twelfth has a chance to still move on. I mean, Sixth even, or fourth, realistically, as the way this thing is going. Yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, that, that's true. Fourth through twelfth, gonna still have the chance to have a tire All switch takes up. All one, folks. All it takes is one. One race to change this entire leaderboard up. So, still a lot of points to be had. A lot of points to change this entire standing going into the sixth race. Oh, absolutely, man. And uh, just uh, just want to say we want to thank our sponsors for making all this possible here. You can see our sponsors at the bottom of the screen right there. 404 Esports PPG Retro World Series. You have Crystal being our uh, big sponsor here today with VG Bootcamp as well, Dual Studios, UGL. We are obviously the sponsors as well as MKC helping us out here. And, dude, Skulls with these Esports jerseys rocking it there you go there you go but we are going to mute city for this sixth race i don't particularly like this track because it is just non-stop pressing a going fast there is no pressing bagging a dude you gotta live by five words hold a and just drive five words exactly <laughs> you know that is the way to live by a mario kart 
but especially being on this track, it is so easy to get 10 coins because those side panels give you coins very, very fast. So it really just comes down to who can get the best items, who can hit these boost panels better, and who has the better driving lines. And there's a no item shortcut that you can take that we're it's probably going to see. It's very difficult to do, though. It is very difficult to do. Maybe we'll see it, maybe we won't, but a lot of these racers know how to do it. Right now, on the screen, Crow, coin in hand, being able to grab that double item box and get up to nine coins. Oh, we got to be careful. Oh, double reds. <laughs> be careful, get everything out of the way there. Two reds. Two reds for Crow. Dash, uh, Dash had to use his red for that draft item. A lot of people taking the double item shortcut. Let's go. Oh, no. He it. no. He didn't do it properly. Too much bumping. He's got to be careful with this uh, white Yoshi with the bomb and the sound horn from Dash. Dash doesn't use it to take out Vantox. Just going to hold on to it for defense <laughs> at I'm this point. I'm already scared for these players, and I'm not the one playing. I told you, Mute City is just dealing with one thing after another after another in a matter of milliseconds. Avoids the back red and the air horn. Grabs a single item box. Red ready to throw forward to Roberto. Has a mushroom in take hand. Take that, Dash. Dash. Take him down. You have the take angle. The, throw it. the no. angle. Take him down. No, he's not going to have a shortcut. And get but Dash off. stopped him. Oh Dash God. stopped him. And why did Dash use the mushroom to take that uh, no item shortcut? Well, I, I really want if Vantox had the lineup to take out Dash uh, anyways and then make the no item shortcut really huge. Huge mistake. Schism. It just takes one of those backwards. Schism got hit out somehow. Between now the great in front of Immortal. Sees him with the green shell. Gonna just use it for defense, checking that back camera, seeing if they can get any information. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And, oh no! Got the camera back no. You ran into the banana and you got pushed off again, bro. This That's is the another red though. Map. They can salvage happened. something here. What? The star. Now we got Miles on the screen. <laughs> I got to breathe. Oh, oh wow, Greg got second in the line. Then you got Miles second, second. Did Greg even get third? I don't know. Bobby grabs first. Dash got third. Greg got moved down to fifth. Immortal grabs last on that race. Oh, that's brutal. Oh, my God. Oh. Was, children, cover your cover your eyes. That was too violent of nature. Too much blood being shed there. Cover your eyes, please. The Mario they, Karting. Oh, the children. <laughs> the Mario Karting, just too much. It's too much. So oh, Bobby man. with 60 points in total in first, Dash in second with 58, Vantox in third with 55, Miles in fourth with 45, Roberto in fifth with 41, Crow in sixth with 40, Schism in seventh with 37, Greg Island in eighth with 35, Zach in ninth with 34, Immortal in tenth with 31, Mancolor tying with them is Jacob in eleventh with 28. Oh, this is still anyone's chance to get Only in that top six. Only six are moving on because this is semifinals. Only six are moving on to finals. And this is race seven. We're we almost have done. Six, five other races left after this. We're almost done. We're going to Mushroom Gorge. The gap, get the gap jump of the century coming at you live. I really wonder who's going to make it and who's going to mess up because that no item shortcut, it's already showing that these racers aren't accustomed to having so many other people beside them when they're trying these very very difficult strategies. Oh, 1,000%, man. The gap jump being the hardest one. We saw that earlier today with uh, some of the uh, earlier folks back in that quarterfinals. And right now, we're on Miles, who's currently the, the pack leader. Fires off the coin, drags the green now, collecting his coins, oh. and his top speed. No. Oh. He's gonna careful with his red, and getting bumped off. That is insane. The red shell went to second place, so Miles didn't get redded out, and they're able to grab a banana in hand right now. And we see Immortal going for the gap jump, and they made it, grabbing that first place for the second lap. But hey, 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 all he's got is that shroom right now, as far as we're aware. Miles had to defend himself, and here we are. We're on this competitor over here, playing the link, in fourth, right behind uh, Jacob. This is Greg in fourth. Absolutely. And has the ability to do the gap jump, which they're probably just going to get to 10 coins. Blue and shell comes out to Immortal. Oh, Immortal. Oh, no! no! How do you make you that doing? mistake? Going off the boost ramp. That's going to drop him all the way down to eight. That potassium ain't saving you, brother. That is. No! No! <laughs> <laughs> no! What? What? 
Big Cap shall be saved by the bullet bill that cut it time so early just to save. <laughs> the luckiest person <laughs> in Mario Kart at this point. I'm gonna have to lose my voice tomorrow, bro. There's too many exciting plays here. All right, grabbing the double item box. Greg, oh, has the ability to do the same thing. Probably just gonna use the golden mushroom to try and grab uh, another mushroom to take the gap jump. And now, are they just- Oh, no! He had the bill! He was trying to avoid the bomb! I would have played it, but that would have avoid oh, the shot! No. He's getting hit again! Can he do the gap jump? He doesn't have the speed! <laughs> He's losing spots! <laughs> I'm hearing the crowd going, no! Uh, He's getting blue! Uh, <laughs> After the line, down uh, the line! Miles of first, probably second, pass, action third, Mortal and fourth, attack, and fifth, and dash, and sixth. Oh, Great let me breathe! Day. You are making my job harder! Let me breathe! My God! Greg, uh, <laughs> And we talked about it. The mental, the Ooh. absolute Ooh. disappointment when you have done this thousands of other times, making the gap jump making these strats Ooh. and literally when it happens on stage on the biggest stage of mario kart history it is so much more brutal it is so much more intense and you're just not expecting it and will greg be able to come back from this disastrous race that's the question we'll have, we'll have to wait and see time will tell folks i mean like there's still a good amount of action left we're on what, race eight yes race eight Let's go, Super Bowl. Please pick it, even though everyone else hates it. I love Super Bowl. <laughs> the train aesthetic gives me life, but we're Do not going to get that today. Oh, uh, we guess we're going to Amsterdam Drift. This is Van Tox's home turf. Oh, there you go. All right. You know, honestly, I enjoy this track. It's a little bit more difficult with the underwater sections that happen. But overall, it's a really fun track. I think Nintendo's done an amazing job with these DLC courses. So if you haven't checked them out, please do. They're really pretty, very nice, and fun to race on. As of right now, man, uh, there's a lot of scores happening here. There's a lot of action. I'm seeing only a few 60s. Everyone else is in the 40s. Only 170. Let's see what Greg can do here. We are off. Currently working the way up to all the way to third, actually, off that draft, which is huge. Let's see if they can nice keep their stream. spot here. Let's see if behind Miles gets the second slipstream, doesn't get the double, goes for the single there. Miles with the coin, you got Greg with the banana. It is visible in everyone's uh, POV because they can see it in their hands and he's dragging it. He's gonna what go a chain into the double. Yeah. No, he holds on to the banana going to the double. Gotta be oh, careful, no, run away. Gotta be careful, run away, Greg. Oh, there's an air horn right behind him. With five coins, they are going a little bit faster, but now with the drift, they're slowing down. He, to he to went the wide to avoid being sound horned by Bobby. They'd rather lose screen. one or two spots than to lose five or six. I don't blame Greg for that smart play. Yeah, really good move there. And you know what? I love that they went from 12th or, 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 or from ninth to all the way to almost first place and holding first place for a little bit and then having to just get out of the way. Now we see Immortal in fifth. We see Jacob and Crow in front of him in fourth and third place. Sees the triple oh, greens and get, Jacob gets backed. And now Immortal here in fourth uses the shroom for the shortcut. Beautiful move there. Sees the piranha play behind him. And line, now. Folks. Greg in second place. Blue though. Shell coming in right now. Oh. Crow hits Immortal down with the sound horn. Now that Yoshi is getting hit with the blue. I think they have Oh, he jumped friends. over the red. And then Triple Red's going to be able to salvage this race just a little bit. No! Gets hit by the bullet bill. Crow now using Island the Island in front right now as Lee. Greg, will he be able to take it home? Or is Crow going to stop him? Or is someone not going to let second place do their job? Let's see. Crow in second, last turn, and they will grab it. Greg redeems no, himself no, with Pete their no. Ruin their race. Oh. Don't give them hope. Make them fall into despair, folks. Hit them at the line. Back them. That's how I play this game. And I ain't nobody's friend. That. Bobby, currently the point leader at this at this section of the tournament, and it's just showing how comfortable they are on stage. After going to the HyperX Arena in Vegas every single week, they and are third just place so the comfortable here. Last night, by the way. Exactly. So much practice. Just With knowing what you got to do. Knowing what you have to do. But also, we got to give credit to Greg. After having the most disastrous race of the night. Is that Mr. Nigel's words with a subscription of Prime? Thank you for subscribing to MKC. That is insane. Absolutely Bonkers. Great work Ball by Greg, Luigi though. Stadium again. 
Yeah, honestly, I'm shocked. These are like I the consistent, again, likable tracks that we're seeing so far. I mean, what's your favorite DLC track so far? Singapore Speedway. All right, fair. Everyone's gonna give me flack for it, but I don't care. Singapore. I like the I like the soundtrack. I like the aesthetics. I think it's great. Now, as far as a racing track is concerned, that's a different take. That's fair. That's fair. But as of right now, Bobby is in the lead with 82 points. Bantock to 73. Dash and 72 points in third. Miles to 66. Pro with 55. Greg with 54. Zach 51. Roberto 48. Skidder 44. Tying with the Merle on that. Matt Kalora 35 and Jacob 32. Wow. This is still extremely close. This is still semi, yes. It's going to be a battle for that top six spot because guess what? Then you get to battle to get even more money. Remember, these racers are competing for that first place prize of $1,600. So there is a lot of money on the line. Second place getting $660. So it's a huge difference. You want to get into grand finals and have a chance at that ginormous prize payout right now on J Dash on the Daisy. He's currently the see third the blue place shell. point leader. It barely was the blue. We got some uh, flickering happening. That's all right. Stuff happens all the time. Has a shroom in hand. Now we move on to Jacob. He's going to take the shroom for the cut and take the tightest line possible. <laughs> but I think he was trying to play Tony our Pro Skater. Yeah, no, that was that was the tightest line possible going on to the off-road almost. And now we're going to see Boom doesn't get the trick off the rock, though, which is a little bit brutal. Going to get fired out. Drop oh, all the way down to fourth bump. place. Now going for the double item box. Grabs a red and a horde. Triple green's behind him. They see it. Oh, Got to oh, be oh. careful. Has the horde. No, oh, they're I, in the I star, saw what though. he was trying to do. Get rid of the triple greens, but he didn't know they were in the star. So, unfortunately, that was more of a wasted item. But I'd rather protect yourself because you could have got hit with those greens, but he got hit with the star. So there's not much you can really do in that situation. Besides, either hold the horn or just use it and pray. Jacob in seventh. One more redemption time for this short guy. Goes a little bit wider than they wanted to and gets hit by a bullet Rip. bill. And now getting bumped to the side. Red shell right in front of him. And that red's going to go all the way to that competitor who had that red. Miles getting fired. Going to throw the red forward to dash. It lands. Roberto also getting hit. Bobby in front of him has one more shroom in third place. Miles in fourth. Uses their shroom. Bobby with the Whoa. green fire coming out. Miles avoids Whoa. it all. Grabs third. But oh! Oh, Why'd you say it so early? Now he got the fifth because you're trying to call it early. Van Tox in first. Immortal second. Oh, Bobby in third. No. Back and forth. Miles in fifth. Brutal. Brutal. Now we're seeing it. We're seeing it. You it's had to say to he was it. getting third. You cast a curse at him out of a position, and I love it. Everyone else is going to hate you for it, but I won't. It's got, you, you know, you <laughs> got to do it at least once a night. You know, when you're doing the commentating, it happens. But right now, we are seeing a very close battle with top or with a lot of racers who are trying to get that top six spot. Currently, Greg at 63, Crow at 60, Immortal at 56, Roberto at 54. And Zach at 52 and Schism at 46, Van Calor 38, Jacob at 36. With not many races left, it is going to be a battle. You gotta have top play finishes and you gotta have them now. There's no more time to wait. You literally cannot hesitate no more. You gotta make some action. You gotta make some plays. And right now we're gonna be going to oh. MK8DX Rainbow Road. I do love this Rainbow Road. I know people hate it. But I love the aesthetics. Space is really cool. I love it. And you're a fool. I'm kidding. I'm trying to rhyme with you. I don't know what to do there. But we Thank got you. ten. We're on race ten. We only have two more after this. There's no more time to hesitate. You have to make a play, and you have to make it now if you're going to advance. You cannot be patient no more. So we might see a lot of mentality shift. Pro now gonna start off in seventh place. Let's see. Going to be battling it out and get bumped to the side all the way down to 11th. It is a battle. No one's going to bag on this track, which is quite interesting, with the shock changes. Now, when you don't, you don't fall anymore, so this track is a lot more competitive front running than it ever has been. Oh, 1,000% right now, man. And this glider section doesn't help for whoever's in first because that glider section makes it look like they're so far apart from everyone else that even second place can get a star just from that. Let's see, Crow gonna be able to grab that single item box. Still has some shrooms, sees the triple bananas, Immortal has them. 
But right now there's a blue shell coming in. Crow going to the side, avoiding it. Doesn't have to worry about the red. Good use of the back camera to pay, pay attention to what might be hazardous to your health. Mangalore taking two Beautiful people out. Horn. Now in the lead, but Crow just behind with the trimming hand. Crow in a very vulnerable spot right now. Now there's Thor here to help change the status. Gonna be able to grab that single item box. Mancolor still in first place. Oh, well, we gotta be careful of that drag banana. That's why he was going to the side more. Maybe hit a little bit of that break button. Yeah, no, really great awareness there. Being able to just say, I'm gonna slow down, not get dragged out. Oh, 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 oh. oh that was the tightest side I've ever possibly seen so far though for that banana. So quick. That banana side like, would have been nasty if it happened. Crow now no, in no, first. Dude, be careful. I understand you got lines. I understand you're trying to snake some drift right now, but you are literally making me on my edge of my seat right now, ready to drop bricks. They're on the edge of their seat too. I can see it right now. We're in first place. Let's see what they're going to be able to do here. Just dragging the banana right now. Honestly, at this point, you got to just pray that all the RNG and luck is going to be on your side going now, down Greg to the final lap. Now, Greg has a choice lap. to make. Does he use the shroom and his other item to chain for doubles? Or I would just does hold, he on, hold to on, it. on to it and try to protect the oh, lead. Oh no! He has to use it to prevent. There's another blue happening. Right Why did he use the horn? I thought he horned the blue for a second. No, Crow is gonna get hit by the blue shell. Great grab! I thought place. he horned that blue and protected Crow for unknown reasons, but somehow, some miracle, he gets first, and Crow unfortunately dropped down the fifth. Oh, that's brutal, what? Bobby, with the 102 right now. And look at that, the first player to hit triple digits in this semifinals. Man, it is very close. With only two races left, Bobby 102, Van Tox with 94, Dash with 84, Greg with 78. Tied with him is Miles. Sixth place is Crow with 68, Zach with 64, Roberto with 63, Immortal with 63, Schism with 48, Mancolor with 41, and Jacob with 37. It's literally looking to be about from eight to six right now. Yeah, uh, eight, I no, mean, nine through went, six, because technically there's a tie for eight. If we put like every silver lining, every star is aligned, technically, Mancolor still has a, ch no, 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 never mind. I, uh, Jacob is actually, uh, no, you know what, Mancolor still has a chance. Jacob. Schism has a higher chance. Yeah. With a higher point total. Yeah, Mancolor. Well, with your pinball. I think we could say that Jacob probably does not have a chance to come back in this tournament. They're pretty well, he much can done. still do some damage. He can. He can ruin anyone else's day, but Jacob is looking pretty done in terms of if all the stars align, Mantlor still has a chance to move forward. But once again, if all the stars align. All right, Waluigi Pinball. I remember the shock happening here and so deadly, but then we changed it away with me and it hurts my soul. Anyway, let's go ahead and start Waluigi Pinball Stadium here, whatever we want to call it here. Greg in the pack, Zach in second, Roberto quickly passes the body now, and everyone's getting slip screens and drags all over. Yeah, these final two races are going to be the most crucial ones for Whoa. many different racers. We're seeing them all get dragged out on these turns. Zach, oh, oh he takes got hit the turns on right. Oh, that's brutal. Brutal. Zach, going to be well, able to. some points, man. You got to have to talk points. I like your analogy of how you explain points. Having 10 points is such a difference between zero, where it's like you're going from 40 to 50 miles per hour. It is. So you can just take it as, yeah, exactly that. If you have 10 points, you're going 45. The person behind you has five, you're going 40. It is a substantial difference, like Whoa. we're in right now with the portal. Whoa. Unfortunately, he's gonna get hit. And the now Bob gonna hit Schism there. And now Immortal dropping all the way down to 10th place. Yeah, he still has time to catch up. This track is kind of long. He has a lot of twists and turns. So there is still plenty of time, and he's got an additional lap to do this. But he needs to make a play. He needs to make it now. He's tied with Roberto with 53 points. Sixth place at 68. So he needs a good last two races. Yeah, this being one of them. Yeah, absolutely. Like I said, so many races. Oh, the red! Beautiful awareness there by Immortal. Just go off to the side. Don't get hit by the red. Find a coin run and get up to 10 points. Bro, oh! You're gonna avoid fire and the bullet bill. That was definitely the Matrix by the stall. And a void star, and a void pinball, and a void blue show. Taking the side pass. Double avoid. What? Five, and the stars, and the blade couldn't avoid the shot. What just happened? 
what maneuverability <laughs> from Crow there, getting around every obstacle. I'm about to lose my voice right now. I'm literally feeling my voice about to die right now. Let's oh, go. it's the mic already. No, no, oh, the no. Guy will signal. Change the pump. Change it to someone else. That's what trying to catch back up. Oh, it's a great no. action. Crow, he's looking focused. We can only touch There we go, someone. there we go. We're back on screen. Crow, we're going over we're going the back. back. All right, in a place, going to have two points in their name, which is not good on this final lap. So have the double item box. Oh, oh what a deadly no combination. Deadly. But he gets hit with that star. He's down to ninth place. He's got to be careful with this bullet. Oh, oh it's coming. Oh, he's gonna hit. Oh, no. He Bill, avoid star, but he had to lose so much speed. Now he's down to last. He doesn't get a Bill, but he does. Get oh, done. he summoned Otis Beard to stroke that down to infinity. I don't think it's gonna help him at all there. Great, grabbing eighth place. Only five points to their name. And now we're gonna get the point total. Vantox crossing that triple digit threshold as well. We've got it here, and we've got it now. The final race of this semifinals is going to start now. It is looking so close to fight for that sixth place spot. Right now, Bobby in first with 112, Vantox with 109 in second, Dash in third with 87, Greg in fourth with 83, Miles in fifth with 82, and then Immortals at 72 at six. Oh my but God. But seventh place, which is Crows at 70, so he's only two points behind. And then you got Roberto in eighth at 69. Nice, by the way. In eighth place, Zach in ninth at 65, Skizzle oh in 10th at 56, Mangalore in 11th at 53, and Jacob in last at 44. It's literally, it's going to be a battle for six. Immortal has to stay on his A game as we go to what I call the Bobby Special, Mario Kart Stadium. I think it's only suitable that we finish off at a stadium for this final race of semifinals number one. This is the best 12 racers from this competition battling it out with this final race. Hey, 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 has to do first. Get ready to come up and take over because my voice is dying. Immortal, <laughs> gonna be able to land that no item trick guy. Uses the red, goes up to first place. All right, all right, that's good. He needs a solid finish. If he doesn't, this can knock him out. He needs to stay in the top spot, but there is a shroom behind him, so he doesn't have to worry about a red, but they can't worry about getting past. What is he going to take the glider back? cut? It, oh, oh! Thank God he did it. He would have been hit by that green. Almost got hit by the green, but guess what? In a really good spot now, being able to use that glider strat, and now in first place, the red isn't going for Immortal, which is huge for them. Currently, going to be able to take this no item short up once again, grab the SM2 Pro in third place, sees the red in front of him, has the opportunity to take out Jacob, but Jacob already out of the running at this point, but you need as many points hey, as possible. Hey, 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 I don't care if you're out of the running. You play until the very end. You play at the last second. So true, so true. Oh, oh Jacob is back! Why are you being such a jerk to Jacob? But you are keeping the first place spot and then shock happens, never mind. Yeah, shock happens, a few people do dodge in the mid pack. So we'll see if they're gonna work their way up. Currently, Immortal is second, and we're seeing Mario Everyone's catching third. up now. It, it's no longer you had a safe situation for the jet. Now everyone's there. Oh, oh no! Bro, bro is much behind Immortal. He needs to beat Immortal in order to advance. Grab the double item box. That is huge. Immortal, unfortunately, gets one of their items ghosted in third place. Has the opportunity to make it. Red Shell is coming their way. Back to the fire. Has the glider strat. They're in third. They're I able to do it. it. They grab third place. Spot. I think he kept the sixth place spot. Ten points. We're going to see it. That's a one point difference. Oh my god. god! Immortal makes it by one point! My god, Bobby with 127 in first! Vantar uh. with 115 in second! Greg in 92 points in third! Dash with 91! Miles with 84! And Immortal with 82! They are going to be moving on to finals! Unfortunately, Roberto in seventh with 81! Zach with 73 in, nine, in eighth! Crow with 71 in 9, Schism in 10th and 61, Mancalore in 11th and 56, and Jacob in last and 51. Your nights end here, but oh you made God. the semifinals. You were in a stacked position here. It was not easy. All of them need to be commended for their hard work and effort. They really do, and we have to also recognize Miles 
only made yeah. it by another two points as well. So guess what? These two were battling. It was neck and neck. It was absolutely insane until the final ending. But we got to give credit where credit is due. Bobby and Vantox, the ones to be taken down in this tournament. You got to look out for them. You got to see where they are and really, really be aware of what they're doing in these races. They did such a phenomenal job. 127 points. It's insane.